Hey you guys, your girl Tessiki, and I'm here with Baddies, Baddies Midwest, and I'm here with Great Team News. Big Kiva is still talking. Yes, Big Kiva is still running her mouth about Tashiki. Uh, she has revealed herself to be a rock tart, an unstable creature, a bottom feeder. Okay. Like, I don't know. I had to find my audience for real. Who is, who is your audience? Speak <laughs> black, toxic, bottom feeders. You, you a hater. Yeah. Full of women, cuz. House full of sensitive ass females dealing with they damn hormones. Y'all some unstable creatures. See, I ain't gonna say the B word. I'm gonna say unstable creatures. It's my new word. Yeah, she didn't reveal herself, okay? So she got a lot to say about Tashiki. She looking for a storyline. She is looking for a storyline. She trying to get back on the show. She trying to get back on the show, okay? Um, I don't know how that's going to work. Even though I know Natalie and Lemmy is about their money, they're not super sensitive. But I just don't see, I just don't see why they would even bother about bringing Kiva back. You know, y'all let me know if y'all, if y'all disagree. I guess the only reason would be the simple fact is that she willing to go through the gauntlet of fighting. She says she want to fight Anna. She says she want to fight Biggie and she want to fight Tashiki. Y'all know we really want to see her fight Tashiki. They might bring her back, but I doubt it, especially where her coming out talking about these allegations about Lemmy, you know, being, you know, really disrespectful and mean to women and blah, blah, blah. I don't know. I don't know. All right. So check this out. She is willing to do her job with anybody. I just saw her on live television wanting to do her big one with her sister. She looked at production and said, I know what y'all want, but she came in here on peace. I said, oh, this looks too familiar. But you just said you weren't on that. You just wanted an apology. So you did come to fight your sister. Um, well, she said she was down to fight. She said she said for sure she was ready to fight because she know what type of timing uh Krayshawn on. And look what she was saying. You know, I mean, she was saying some crazy stuff. She keeps saying it's not true. Okay. They uh she's saying it's not true, and Krayshawn saying it is. But it's crazy because remember the, the whole family got allegations like that, whether it's chi uh, China, you know, charity. It's, it's like Eugene, Mookie, they all got these crazy allegations of them basically being on some form of incest. It's super weird. It's super weird. So I, I'm not surprised whatsoever. Okay. Just like you tried to make it seem like I had a problem with you when I didn't and you got the fuck up again uh -huh. and you looking like they said. Mm hmm. You doing your job. Clocky. I see now. Clocky. Clocky. You it's really do your job. You're really a robot. That's what the fuck is going on with you. Girl, you scared of her. Y'all know I was signed with Kiva at first. Because I was like, nah, I don't think she's scared to fight Tashiki. I, I don't think they want to fight each other. Nope, I was wrong. I was wrong. Girl, you got a lot to say about Tashiki when she's not in your face. She was right in your face. You didn't want no problem. I love you, girl. You know I love you, Tashiki. Robotic. Robotic. You robot give a robot, percent. baby. That's all. But when it came hey, to hey, Jay, hey, Jay. It was, that, that's who you want on. But when it came to you and when it came to J.O., who was on something? Who did they job right then and there? Period. You know what? <laughs> she didn't do her job then. Like like Biggie said on that lab. Oh, yeah, my friend's going to do her job. I, I can't get touched. That's why Jay don't smack your ass in front of your friend that you said you couldn't get touched in front of, bitch. Now what yeah. happened? Ain't nobody jumping, try to kick Jay up. You got to We proved the point. Point is proven. Hello. Bitch, we, I ain't see Anna A Town Stump legs come in and try to do the A Town Stump thing. Mm hmm. No shade. That bitch so Jay, get away from me. Do you ain't finna sneak me? And, and did, and did. And did, and did, and did. No shade. She was willing to do her job with anybody. I just saw her on live television wanting to. Come on, and did no no shade when it was all shade. Like, what are you talking about? The, the whole the whole little rant that she just did was all shade. What is she talking about? Man, she want to be back on Zoo so bad. I'm telling y'all, I think she, I think she's off her meds allegedly. 
that's the vibe that I've been getting from her. Okay. That's the vibe I've been getting from her. Okay. Th this girl, you it's all in her eyes. Like she just don't seem like she's all the way there. Y'all can let me know if I'm, you know, if I'm a little off base about that. But when it comes to Kiva eyes, look. The way she be talking and looking into the camera and tilting her head back and her eyes be bulging out and stuff, it you know, it's a little scary. To whereas though, if Kiva come my way, I, I'm walking the other way. I'm crossing the street, okay? I I, I don't know. It's, it's some 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 off about her. Yeah, man. Um, I don't know. I, I, I just I just feel like she's a little weirdo right now. Uh, she got a lot to say all of a sudden. Um, you know, and she just keeps saying that she wasn't scared of Tashiki. She said production, she she blaming production and stuff, and oh, you didn't do nothing to J.O. It's like, no, it's about you. J.O. did her big one against Biggie, right? But we got fans that speaking on the situation when it comes to Tashiki and uh Krayshawn. Okay, um, let's see what she has to say, man. Shout out to the House of Blues for the post. She wrong. She knows she wrong. It's like she's always had it out for Tzatziki. Like, even when she had got her on baddies, she want her to put herself in situations. She want her to become a bully. She want her to fight her battles. Like, it's just, I don't, mm -mm. And then for you to get on this internet and say that she has saved you, and you know that's not a light subject. That's nothing that's taken lightly. That's, that's not... I, that's not nothing to joke about. And for all your sisters and everybody around you, your best friends, everyone to get on the internet and say you lying. And it's like, why would you even do that? For you to just act like you got out of jail, you on this spiritual journey, and then you doing stuff like this. Like, I, I don't believe nothing Krishan say. And I just feel like I'm glad everybody is speaking up to say that this girl is a clout chaser and she always be lying. And truth be told, I think she's really upset that. And truth be told, I think. I'm telling, I mean, before she continue. That's kind of like how I feel. All right. That's kind of like how I feel. It's just we've been clocking too much tea when it comes to, you know, the evil that Krishan can produce. OK, she be lying. She's a uh, she's a liar, a cheater, a deceiver, heartbreaker. And I don't want you back in my life. So I'm taking the house, the cars, the kids, the dog. I want it all. And where is Blue Rock? The dog. Where the dog at? That's a whole other conversation. We didn't trust her with a damn dog, which, but we trusted with Junior? Come on, man. And remember, once you get on her bad side, she start saying some wild allegations about people. All right? That's with all of them. It's weird. They talk about SA like just so freely. I'm telling you, the whole, all the Malones, man, they got some weird, crazy trauma, generational curses going on with their family. Trauma, violence, addiction. Like, it's a lot going on. Okay. But yeah, whenever anybody gets on her bad side, that's when she throws some weird allegations on you. And, she, and she's admitted that she's lied. But. I'm moving on a little too fast. I'm going to show y'all. Y'all know we don't just be talking. I'm going to show y'all, okay? But let's see what uh what 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 uh what this chick got to say. I think she's really upset that Tasiki's everything that she wanted to be. Tasiki went and made her own name. She gets own baddies for the reoccurring. She got fans. People love her. And Krishan wanted that. And instead, everybody calling Krishan dumb because she went and followed behind a man. And now look at what happened. What look what led up or what your life looks like now because you decided to follow behind a man. And I think that's so wrong. Like I'm glad that everybody's speaking up for Tasiki because for you to try to tear your sister down and then for them to say that your sister was the closest one to you or the one that was helping you the most when you were pregnant and then you doing her like this, like Krishan, I don't know, all that holy stuff that she doing, you and 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 don't that's not nothing to play with. Like you not living or trying to practice what you preach. You want to post about going to church, all this, and you got this new holy show, this godly show coming out. No, we see right through that. We see right through facts. Facts. I, I feel like she read. I feel like she read. 
I ain't gonna lie. I feel like she read. Um, but you know, that's what we were saying about the whole holy stuff and the God's plan stuff, man. This was for a TV show. This is for her to be seen in a better light by the DA and the judge so she can get a slap on the wrist. And she got a lot of violations. I, I it's gonna be it's gonna be very interesting. Y'all know Krayshawn has court on Friday. She has court on Friday. I'm very interested in seeing how this is going to play out. I'm going to let you guys know right now. I wouldn't be surprised if Krayshawn gets uh, another continuance. And they pushed it. They, they, they try to keep pushing this basically into next year. I can see this happening. Because she's already been pushed, what, twice, right? Her original court date was like September 24th or something. Remember, it was about two weeks after she got released. I think she got released around the 8th or 9th of September, right? Um, and then she had, what, that court date, the uh, the end of September, they pushed it. Then it was pushed to October. They pushed it. Now it's in November. So I wouldn't be surprised at all. I wouldn't be surprised if we don't get, like, a final verdict or, you know, some sense of closure when it comes to Krayshawn and her legal troubles uh, this Friday. I can definitely see it, especially during the holidays. They can push everything back to the beginning of next year. Okay. But um, yeah, I'm 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 just the, the Malone's got too much going on. All right. They got they, they got way too much going on. Okay. Um <laughs> let me see. Let's see. So Y'all know Natalie was throwing shade. So this was Krayshawn's entrance when she came in on baddies, right? She came in with Junior with the stroller, wearing all the white and all of that stuff, right? And, you know, acting like she's angelic and stuff like that. But it's funny because if you look later into the episode, maybe literally like two minutes later, Krayshawn was saying that she don't smoke or drink no more, okay? Natalie was like, who you fooling? Like, girl, who you fooling? Okay, let's check this out. Fair use. And you brought the baby. Oh, that's so beautiful. You look so good, girl. It was like an angel walked through the door, dressed in all white, pushing the stroller like the Virgin Mary that she is. Come on, man. Come on, dog. She was throwing shade. <laughs> Bitch. I know you don't I know you don't believe that. I know you don't believe that. That's why I'm not jumping. That's why I just gotta just Come on, man. <laughs> she don't believe that. She she trolling. <laughs> 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 so somebody wearing um all white you know and they pushing the stroller makes them an angel okay <laughs> i'm not stupid okay when it came to this guy's plan all of this stuff changing the way she was just acting on baddies ain't ain't she's not she's the same person she didn't even take no accountability right like let's talk about it all right but i mean i guess the rock tars they can't see remember it's crazy because she she don't even like these people and they keep windmilling for her all right is this a hate page no krishan hates you that's the crazy thing about it because right, everybody came to watch me and i didn't even get to play yeah. Right, I fucking hate these weird ass fans I got. I hate y'all. You know what? They didn't tell me that I had to register. Oh, thank oh, you. Oh, I fans, y'all really be finding me and shit. I ain't. Y'all cool, but y'all ain't that cool. Don't don't keep up with me like that. I ain't that famous, okay? I'm famous, but don't treat me like that. It's scary. Like, I don't give a fuck what nobody say at this point. Real shit. Like. Even my fan pages tag me and what they want to see from me and all this other shit. I want to see this from you. I want to see that from you. I don't give a f what the f you want to see, bro. Y'all some irrelevant people. I mean, thank you for following me. Thank you for supporting me. 
But stop being weird. Like, I'm obligated to listen to y'all motherfuckers because I don't know none of y'all, bro. I don't give a fuck about none of y'all, man. If I was to keep it at being, y'all keeping up with me. I'm not keeping up with nobody that's in my DM saying, Oh, I think you should try this. I think you should try. I'm not trying shit. <laughs> I'm going to keep running this back. <laughs> what are you geeking for? Everybody getting on my nerves, bro. We be having to remind them they, they they love windmilling, right? So I love that. Okay, I love that because we love to throw this stuff in people's face because they're slow. Okay, this girl do not like y'all, but y'all always windmilling, and it's crazy because we show receipts, paperwork, audio, visuals, and you still say it's y'all weird. Y'all weird, bro. So let, let's make them even matter. Y'all ready? Hey, rock tars, unstable creatures. Okay, let's acknowledge y'all real quick. Okay. House full of women, cuz. House full of sensitive ass females. Dealing with they damn hormones. Y'all some unstable creatures. See, I ain't gonna say the B word. I'm gonna say unstable creatures. It's my new word. Unstable creatures. Uh, Explain this. Do y'all remember this? This is why people question uh, her allegations with Tashiki, okay? Because she openly lies about SA situations. Uh, hint, hint, little Mabu, okay? But let's talk about Blueface first and what she alleged on Blueface about Junior. When, when all Blueface was doing, even though I didn't agree with his tactic, right? Right? But we know they live their life on the internet and it had to be extreme because Krishan only moves with the internet she's in the comments come on i'm telling y'all she's all on the internet she watches everything okay all right so he's saying the baby needs some hernia, hernia surgery or something like that she was not keeping up with the appointments the baby was in pain whatever the case may be right so he took the picture to expose his hernia right this was her uh reaction to this okay see now i now i know why your son your other son was taking pictures of his dick. Just because it's his penis and his balls right there. Did that turn you on? What? See, now I, now I know why your son, your other son was taking pictures of his dick. Just because it's his penis and his balls right there. Did that turn you on, Blueface? That's the real question. Okay, post Javon dick pictures that you have in your phone. From his phone when Javon took pictures his phone of his dick you sent them to your phone post that blue face post your other son's dick pictures that, that what like y'all y'all th th this don't sound weird to y'all y'all just y'all just believe everything she say that that like that that don't that don't sound weird what what nigga what that your son took not not the one that i took and sent to you because he has a hernia and i'm being a concerned mom and i wanted you to be concerned about your son too post your other son post his dick so we can know how his dick's supposed to look huh huh you're doing weirdo shit you're doing pedophile shit you're doing gay shit i don't stand for that shit you need to go to hell today see now i now i know why your son your other son and y'all and, and the rock tars be like she's speaking her truth what's the issue well the issue is she admitted that she lied all right after all of this right saying all of this about this man this is before the tattoo on her face this is when she got the tattoo on her neck so after all this she said about this man she gets his mug shot tatted on her face and moved in into his house. And y'all so slow. This is when y'all hated Blueface. When she did that, all of a sudden, y'all was team Blueface. We're the porters. What? And did it, did it, uh, then he kept lying on my name, so I started lying on his name. And did it, uh, then he kept lying on my name so i started lying on his name he started lying on my name so i started lying on her name so she just talking lying 
you, you, y'all don't understand the correlation. It's just unbelievable that she can just lie about something. Like, yeah. super weird, bro. Super, super weird. The 12, 2015. Yes. Okay. Um, and uh, have you been changed in any way according, uh, based on what's in front of you? No. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit. So with something like this that she be talking about, right? Um, we already questioned about how she took care of the dog. That's why we're, we're scared about how she take care of the baby. Okay? Like, this is, like, she's not all the way there in the head. Yeah, lying on my name, so I started lying on his name. And he kept lying on my name, so I... What's crazy is, is that this is the same live where she went dumb on her fans saying that she don't care about y'all and that y'all all broke. She don't care. She still go get money. Go worried about some damn money. All right. But, you know, anyways, it's funny because y'all know the blogs, man, and everybody, the fans, they always go catch what's going on. Right. They always go catch what's going on. So remember on the show. When she was like, oh, let me go get my baby or, you know what I'm saying? Or whatever the case may be, right? Go to the back, right? She said she was like getting the baby from charity, right? But it looked like she, a man had the baby, right? Who is this random man with braids? Y'all seen this? It says, you see, you see Junior with the man in the background before Tashiki walks in. Who is that? Who is this? And that's how I believe the whole thing about um, Krayshawn using Junior as a shield so Tashiki didn't beat her up. Okay? Tashiki called her out on it. She was like, man, you lucky you holding that baby. You feel me? Oh, my baby girl will be everywhere. I'm on probation. I got obligations. Well, you had obligations in probation when you punched your hairdresser on the, uh, on the red carpet of Shayla. What about when you punched um you had you had what's the name too when you punched Rama at the BET Awards? You had probation and obligations. You had probation and obligations when you punched Woe well, Vicky. You had probation and violations when you beat up uh James Chanel Wright. You was literally on the run. So all of a sudden, you care about being on probation when it comes to fighting Tashiki? Stop playing. We not stupid. So this man could have been in the back holding Junior. Why you talk to Tashiki? Nope. You made sure you held that baby. You made sure you held that baby. All right. She was using that baby as a shield. And like I said, the uh, the rock tars, the unstable creatures, the um, the Rockefellers, the Chris Stalkers. Y'all know they uh, worship Krishan. They go to the church of Krishan, okay? Or Krayshan, if you will. Um, they don't care about Junior. They only care about Junior when it comes to Krishan. Okay, they use the baby as a shield so you don't talk talk about her, so you don't judge her. They use the baby as an excuse for her not to go to prison. Outside of that, they don't care. Outside of that, they don't care. All right, so check this out. I was crying. I was crying out on the show. I didn't even. I'm she said, oh, let me go get uh, the baby, my sister. No, it was some man that had this damn baby. Who is that? I'm going to go get a drink, so. Go. Come on, who is that? They said uh, she went to get her baby because her sister haven't seen him in a while. What you mean, what sister? Tashiki never seen the baby before. What sister? What are you talking about? Bro, just be talking, bro. Just making stuff up. She went to grab the baby because the sister haven't seen her in a while. Seen the baby. The sister ain't seen him at all. She was using that baby to protect herself. I highly doubt it. She not scared of her sister. They both got hands, okay? That's how, bro, I'm telling y'all. We know more about Krayshawn than her fans. These people don't even know who she is. or Like, they're weird. For, for somebody to worship, right? They don't know about her. Krayshawn literally said she was scared to fight her. She didn't want her to beat her up. That's why she didn't want her own baddies. 
Do I got to find that clip again? The hell is you talking about? She literally said that to Natalie Nunn and Natalie Nunn clocked her tea. She said, no, you told me you didn't want her on the show. Well, I didn't want her uh, on the show trying to fight me, trying to beat me up. But now all of a sudden she's not scared of her. Y'all don't, don't know what y'all talking about. All right. Look, yeah, somebody had to get in the uh, comments, call her a rock tar. She says, when I see people like you defending rock actions, uh, I go to y'all pages, then I understand why. Because y'all are exactly uh, like her. Y'all are rock tars. Right. They slow. They, 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 what do you expect, though? Get out. We're talking about a little baby in his restaurant. Fuck little baby in his restaurant. Nigga, I'm talking about a kid. You talking about me eating at somebody's fucking restaurant? Like, man, like, it, it's crazy, man. Um, but let me remind y'all, bro. When school was over, when high school was done, they just freed all the special ed kids out into the world, didn't tell us who was who or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Our whole lives in school, we were separated. We knew who were who. We knew, all right, they get the tripping, don't even pay them no mind, they special ed. You know what I'm saying? After high school, they let them out into society, and we don't know, bro. So when somebody trying, you just remember, they probably them. That's probably them right there, bro. Yeah, but, you know, it is what it is, y'all. All right? It is what it is at this point. Um, he said Tashiki maybe did want to see Junior. She she said that. So, of course, she wouldn't, um, even if true. Uh, that's, that's, not, that's, not, that's not the point. It was no emphasis on Junior. All right. Yeah, you said no that she didn't play. Yeah, I'm not I'm not falling for that one. No. There was no emphasis on Tashiki wanting to see Junior or be around Junior or nothing like that. Tashiki wanted to get to the bottom of uh these allegations that Krishan been saying, right? And then let's throw this in uh look, look hey, Rock Tars, answer this. Rockefellers, rock, answer this, unstable creatures, answer this. So we just played the situation where she was putting those allegations on Blueface, right? And took them back. Why is she throwing out the allegations about her, um, about, uh, Tashiki's son, which would actually be Krishan's nephew? What type of, uh, insensitivity is that? Apparently, allegedly, Tashiki's son got inworded, got touched. And then she threw this in her face when Tashiki brought up the fact that Krishan was smoking and drinking while she was pregnant. Come on, man. Let's talk about it. Fair use. I apologize to you because we all was drinking, even you, with the baby and stuff. So Why, are you like, you you Why are you lying? Now you got. Why you lying? Huh? You show Jay. There you, you go. gave me the bottle. There you go. Okay. So you gave me the bottle. You there gave you me the Hennessy bottle. There you go. Bro. There you go. You so can't just track. not about to act. We going off track? No, that's not off track. She's staying on track. She said, "Hey, I apologize." Okay. We was both drinking, all right? Especially you. You was pregnant. Well, well there you go. Lying, building a narrative. Oh, really? I mean, do, do you forgot this is, you know, great T receipts? This is great T renew uh, great T news. All right, great T receipts. What, what what are you talking about? <laughs> That's a lie. There you go. Um you literally said, "Let me go get another bottle." Tashiki said, you can't drink. You pregnant. Yes, I can. I'm about to get rid of the baby. I don't think I want to be a boy. We're having a baby. Get yourself together. Where the bottle at? Oh, my gosh. Drink it. She asked for another bottle. I'm just going to get a liquor. Yes, I can. I can abort the child tomorrow. It won't hurt me. No, you can't have no fucking liquor. You don't want to have a kid. I don't want to have a kid. Oh, why is Brett? Mental illness. This is a mental illness to just lie bold face like this. And the rock tar is just... They just ignore this. It's weird. It's weird. Like you putting us in that you put a narrative out there. What, you, what narrative? Tashiki, like, what narrative? What are you talking about? You was drinking. I was there. She was there. What narrative? You trying to say I drunk. Nigga, you, I never drank the bottle. Cause I never so was who was drinking. I never drank the bottle. You know I didn't drink the bottle. What? Bruh, this is crazy. Like, for real. Nigga, did you know that I can see you? I know you don't, I know you don't believe that. I know you don't believe that. That's why I'm not jumping. That's why I just got it. Just... Oh. That's crazy. 
us bringing up this y'all they still say the same thing leave her alone you're a hater what about junior give her a chance only god can judge her she didn't give junior a chance how about that f you talking about you weirdos leave Brittany alone please <laughs> So, okay, I don't give a fuck because you just keep on. Your baby is blessed. His name is Krishan Jesus. My baby is blessed. His name is Krishan Jesus. Tashiki, like, all babies are blessed. No, my baby is blessed. Like, my baby specifically. Uh, he is blessed. He's blessed. Every child is blessed. Oh, no, he's really blessed. I'm not saying that. See, you're so defensive. Look at her. She knows what she did. She'll never be accountable for what she did to this baby. She'll never be accountable for what she subjected this baby to. All right. But they defend this. I, I don't know. I, I, I don't get it. I, I, I never understand. You know. I never I'm said it wasn't what she's talking about. She just tried to bait my son and don't play with Krishan. Okay. And now she's talking uh spicy with her not there. You was not talking this spicy with uh Tashiki. Like in her face. Let's talk about it. She was not talking this spicy. But when it come to um charity, right? She got all of this to say. When Jesus like that, bro. I can see Don't talk about Jesus like that. Which is blasphemy in in in, in its own right. But that's a whole other conversation. Say what happened to her son. I don't talk about what happened to her son. What? You mean your nephew? Stop saying it. Your son, like, like you have no connection to that boy. That's your nephew. How would I do that? We got to protect our kids. You got to protect your kids. Oh, bro. She got some nerve, bro. Yeah, that's mental illness for sure. The 12, 2015. Yes. Um, and uh, have you been changed in any way according uh, based on what's in front of you? No. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit. Wow. You are a goofy no, bitch. No, that's not true. It's not even that. Why won't you worry about your son and the people that molested your son? Like what? Like she talking about her nephew, the people that in water her son. Wow. Like what? They never bring this up though. They never bring this up, though. What type of jab is that? Okay. She said, hey, you was you was drinking when, when you was pregnant. I was there. You're putting a false narrative. You're lying. How am, I, how am I lying? And my baby's blessed. You talking about my baby. That's what the rock tars do. They weirdos. When we talk about when we talk about the truth, hey, she was smoking and drinking when she was pregnant. You're talking about a, you're talking about a baby. Nah, we're not talking like bad about him and nothing like that we're talking about Krishan and what she subjected this baby to while he was in her womb he's blessed yeah we know he's blessed he's an angel he's a warrior he's supposed to be here because she didn't want him here do we got to keep bringing up the tea the hell are you talking about I know it's his kids I don't care I'm still killing it that's, that's the fun part about it can we go what are we going listen to his house what I don't know what to do I don't want to do it no more I give the fuck up you don't have to deal with him because he still can raise your baby that's you gotta leave your emotions out of it. Sometimes I left you gotta, it out. You gotta, I got no emotions in my whole. I'm, all right, so uh, you cannot deal with do that to the baby no more. Is that not, that's his baby. I don't want his baby. I don't want to have nobody baby no more, bro. I'm over it. Y'all not listening. I am listening, Muda. Like, I, I don't want to have a baby no more. Y'all keep listen. saying this other shit. Y'all want to be silent. Let me just get this abortion. Leave it alone. I got rid of his kids. Plenty of times before that, you feel me? So it's like, <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? just say it like that. Because I was ready to get rid of this one, like right, well, willingly, like I right, fuck it. He don't want it no more. Fuck it. I should go too with you to get this abortion on. No rush. I don't know what to do. First, I was getting pregnant, and then I abort and shit. Like, ooh, you did not three times with him. So I was just like, all right, we're not ready. All right, you don't want it. All right, cool. 
Mom, I don't want to have a baby no more. I'm getting an abortion tomorrow. Why? I don't believe in that. Children are for the Mom. future. It's not for today. I get it. Well, I'm just saying. Well, give it to me. Hell no. I don't believe that in that, Sean. I had 12. Mom, he don't want to have a kid. I damn near don't want to have a kid. I'm ready to kill this baby. I'm, I'm ready to kill this baby. I made up my motherfucking mind, right? Oh, things gonna rush to my head. Like, damn, y'all. I almost killed you. With abortion. Yeah, that was, yeah, that was protecting Junior, all right. I, I'm, I'm sure, I'm sure that was a very stress-free pregnancy, uh, natural. Um, you know, n nothing was involved. Okay, um, you know, she was getting all the prenatal care that she was supposed to get. Uh, all of that, I, I'm very sure. I, I'm very sure she was eating all her fruits and veggies, um, drinking a bunch of water. Not fighting people, not drinking or smoking. I'm very sure of that. I'm very sure of that. Yeah, we're just seeing things. We're 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 we're, we're blind and we're deaf. That's what she's basically telling us. We're blind and we're deaf. Okay, and it's crazy because their biggest fans, these people that be trolling and all that stuff, it be people that's old enough to be my damn grandma. To see yourself in Krayshawn shows how weird you are. Embarrassment when you was embarrassing your relationship. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Right. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Okay. So I'm gonna protect the babies. This is your nephew. This is Tashiki's son. And you putting it out there that he was touched. Nobody would know that if she didn't say that. I thought she would protect the babies. And you over here lying about Brett. Tashiki, Brett. That's the main person that would not lie. Okay, she was there. Blueface was there. He said she was smoking and drinking. Okay, smoking and drinking throughout her entire pregnancy. There was text messages released from Blueface that Krayshawn was even still smoking, you know, um, after her water broke on her way to the uh deliver the baby. She was smoking and drinking throughout her entire pregnancy. Okay, but it's all about protect the babies. Come on, man. You keep saying shit. I shouldn't even have to apologize to you because we all was drinking, even you, with the baby and stuff. Why are you like, lying? Now you go. You did pull you up go. to your show. Why are you lying, man. Yeah, th this is this is sad. This is sad, bro. This is sad. But this is what they defend. This is what they defend. Okay. So, um, let's play both sides though, because I told y'all. Obviously, I'm not biased. And I believe all of the Malones are liars. I think they're liars. I think they're manipulators. Obviously, it's levels to this, right? All right? Uh, it's levels to this. But I think they're all liars. They're all clout chasers. They're all manipulators. They're all money hungry. They're all willing to throw each other under the bus for some money. And it shows with what they do uh, with each other and to each other, spilling each other tea, exposing each other and stuff, all for clicks and views for content. Okay, so I, I, this is a grain of salt. I'm not listening to Smiley, but I'm just I'm just putting some out there. Just just hear me out. So this is Officer Crystal Burger. This is a uh, Lieutenant um, Lieutenant Crystal Burger, y'all. Lieutenant Slimy reporting for duty, and she's speaking on Tashiki saying that Smiley helped jump her. Because remember, Smiley was in that jump uh, was in the Sprinter van too. When, you know, Marsh and uh, Jay jumped on it, okay? Tashiki claims that Smiley helped them. Smiley claiming that she didn't, all right? But remember, we can't believe nobody that don't even have their real voice, okay? When she talks, she likes to put on this thing called a black scent. If you aren't familiar with that, a black scent, that's when people that are not of FBA descent put uh, this lingo and twang on their voice to make it sound like they're black, okay? Or ghetto, okay? It's very stereotypical too. It's actually very offensive, okay? So let's play this real quick just to let y'all know this is the real Officer Crystal Burger. Again, going to her funeral, I remember her daughter was still wearing a white dress, screaming to the top of her lungs, 
for her mom. Did you wish that you had talked to her about BPLs or did it even change your thoughts about your own surgery? I would have said that would have been a hypocrite because I was going in the next week. She died a week before my surgery. You hear that voice? All right, now listen to Smiley talk. So I just want to clarify something and I think I told you guys this before. I just, I don't know why. First of all, let's just, let me just clarify this. There was no reason for me to put my hands in Tiki. I never pulled her hair. I never did that. And that's just the honest truth. I never got involved in that family shit and I would never, you know what I'm saying? And I was pulling off Marsh and Jay. You would never get into no family-ish, but you yelling at Carlissa back and forth? Trying to expose Carlissa address and information and stuff like that. You would never get between family. Really? That's literally all you do. You literally get into everyone's business but yours. Y'all know that Smiley know everything about everybody, but we don't know nothing about her. That's not weird to y'all. And it's it, it don't and it's hard for her to shake these fed allegations because why would anybody even hang out with her? You know? So you got to give them the side eye too. With all of these stuff that Smiley be doing when it come to doxing people and you still got her around, we got to give you the side eye. You're weird. Offer her respect because I didn't, I ain't really. I don't believe her, by the way, y'all. She lied about everything. So I do believe that uh, Smiley maybe put in a little extra hit or two on tomorrow. She was pulling Marsh and um and Jay off of Tashiki when your allegiance is to Krishan. So you saying you was protecting Tashiki? I doubt that. I doubt it. You know what I'm saying? I'm a real bitch. We don't do all that jumping shit. That shit weird to me. You know what I'm saying? But respectfully, bro. Smiley saying that she's real is insane when she got lip injections and a bbl you're everything but real you're literally artificial wow y'all y'all remember robocop this is a robo thought remember they had to build a a, a rebuild robocop she over here rebuilding herself this is a robo thought okay a robo bop you know, they say that too. Bopper, Thotty. He's a robo bop. Okay. And it's crazy because she got allegations about being about being a damn uh, you know, a fed, an agent, a police. So she is robo cop, robo bop, robo thot. Oh my lord. For you saying that I put my hands on you, bro. You know, you know damn well I never did that. You know damn well, and I have much respect for you, and I got much love for you. My baddie sister, you know what I'm saying? I don't get in between what y'all got going on. And it's dead ass wrong that y'all will even think that I'll do some shit like that. So I just want to clarify. I don't believe her. But this is where I do believe where there's smoke, there's fire. I do believe where there's smoke, there's fire. Just hear me out. Just hear me out. Apparently, Krayshawn is claiming that Tashiki is lying about a lot of the the fight that supposedly happened, you know, between Marsh J when they jumped on Tashiki in the Sprinter van because they had some GoPro cameras, right? That the footage never was released. Because remember, we never got to actually see it, right? We never got to see it like vividly. But they had, I guess, some people that had the GoPro cameras on. And Tay Tay, who is Tashiki's manager slash best friend i guess took the gopros and so we never got to see the direct footage right now tay tay went on camera and said that her and tashiki did take the cameras and took the footage but when krishan brought it up to tashiki she's saying that's a lie so i don't know all right so even in, in, in between that, that don't mean Tay Tay not clocking some tea because she was there, but we kind of catching them up, up in some form of lies. Okay. 
I think all of the Malone sisters be lying. All right. And, you know, Tay Tay was there. She, she was there. She's been there from the jump. Okay. So look, remember, Tay Tay was clocking her tea during the whole sit down and stuff. Okay. And she just wanted to like clear, clear the air because people were trying to make it seem like she was being an apologist of what, you know, uh, Tashiki might have done, you know, allegedly done to Krayshawn. She's saying no. She was saying if, 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 key word on if, okay? So check this out. We go play the clip first, and then, you know, we'll read her uh, her messages. Fair use. Where did it take a time? Because even before, even before you got to Cali, even when Tifa first started her music, Sean, you was dead. Every video shoot, every photo shoot, every studio yeah, session. Yeah, bro. My nigga, you was yes, dead. Like, yes, you knew yes. what Tifa was going to be way really before she had a TV screen. Keep letting her know how I was supported. Keep letting her know how I was supported. Keep letting her know how I was she like, she like, man, what happened in between this time? Tashiki's always been there for you. Y'all always was close, this and that, this and that. Now, all of a sudden, Tashiki start getting some limelight. Uh, your light start dimming because of your legal troubles and basically stuff that you put yourself into. They, Y'all know, the Rock Tars, too, they blame everybody else for Krayshawn, um actions. Y'all know that, right? That's, that's super weird. I never understood that. I never understood that. They blame everybody else for her actions, which is literally solely on her. But I digress. Remember, that's our fault for using our brain, for making sense, okay? Supportive. Thank you. I was always supportive and still is. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. she might Whatever sister. happened to y'all when y'all was children, right? When y'all was children, right? When y'all was children, well, whatever happened. Me? So you didn't forgive her, her so much. all the time. I didn't, the she together. ain't dropped me off because I needed so to ride. Never, I can't, she, she came with all me. All the time we was together. I don't want to hear that. Family. I you hear what y'all saying. You had to forgive her because you was a leader. Forgive what? You pointed back up once you came to Cali. I went to Cali because I went to college. I went to college. If it's something the family go through, go through it. So you bring it back up when you get a platform so it can be so it could be what? Televised? If this is something y'all been through in your family, what why is not standing in the family? Why you gotta wait till you get to a black I get what you're saying, you want to throw it back up? Where, where did it take a time? Because even before, even before you got to Cali, even when Tifa first started her music, Sean, you was dead. Every video shoot, every photo shoot, every studio session. Yeah, bro, My nigga, Jesus. you was dead. Yes, like, yes, you knew yes. what Tifa was going to be you, way you, before you, she had a TV screen. Keep letting her know how I was supported. Keep letting her know how I was supported. Keep letting her know how I was supported. Thank you. I was always supportive and still is. What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah. she might Whatever sister. happened to y'all when y'all was children, right? When y'all was children, When y'all was well, children, whatever happened. Me? So you didn't forgive her, her. So all the time. I didn't, the she together. ain't dropped me off because I needed so to ride. Never, I can, she, she came with me. All the time we was together. I Why don't want to hear that. that. I hear what y'all saying. You had to forgive her because she was a leader. You forgive You brought it back up once you came to Cali. I went to Cali because I went to college. I can't to college. If it's something the family go through, go through it. So you bring it back up when you get a platform so it can be Talking about televised. If this is something y'all man, Krayshawn keep bringing up this college. Krayshawn went to Santa Monica College. Okay, that's not even like a state school or nothing like that. I want to say that's like a community college, right? For for one, for two, you went there for like two weeks. As soon as you got there, you and um um Ronnie get into a situation towards you. Y'all had to unalive a man. And remember, the Rock Tars hate him, and he went to jail for her. But y'all know, we 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 can't you know we we can't bring receipts. We we can't make sense. So, anyways, Tay Tay uh, defends herself because people were in the comments saying that you know she was excusing what uh, Tashiki allegedly might have done to Krayshawn. So she says, "I said if this happened to you, why wait till you get on a platform to say some ish like that? If some ish like that happened." Someone in your family should be the first to know, not the world. I wouldn't live with my, you know, the person that harmed me. I wouldn't repay the person that harmed me by bringing them to Zeus. I wouldn't make my, uh, you know, the person that harmed me baby pick my profile picture. Oh, all that goes to say it never happened. She got a platform and you hate the people uh, and you hate that people like her. So you say the lowest to make people change their perspective of how they look at her just to try and ruin her character. It's sad, but very true. Uh, if that happened to you, bitch, it ain't our business. 
That's between you and your family. But you said it publicly just to tarnish her because you mad she going up. You want people to hate her. That's demonic. That's evil. If you don't get what uh, the F I'm saying, I don't give a F. I said what I said. Now, bye. Oh, I, I, oh, y'all, that was a read. That was a read. What, what y'all think? That's basically what she said. Okay. You are a goofy no, bitch. No, that's not true. You keep talking, man. And you shut the fuck up. Huh? Right. Just say what we want. Uh, really, shut when you think about fuck it. up. Message. That's basically what she said. Okay. And, and a lot of it makes sense, man. Everybody says this. Tashiki said it. Um, Blueface has said it. Carlissa has said it. Wack has said it. When Krayshawn gets mad, she says some outlandish things about you. And it's weird. And it shows how much trauma this family got. They weird. It's always something about S.A. Okay? She beef with um Ronnie. I mean, not, not not Ronnie, uh, Lil Mabu. All of a sudden, she basically saying that he attempted to essay her, right? Try to grope her and, and you know, get up on her and stuff like that. What? Oh, okay. You get into it with Blueface. Blueface try to expose what's going on with the baby. You, you expose, I mean, you uh put some allegations on him for one that he's zesty and that he wanted to have relations with the baby what who says stuff like this okay um tashiki says she ain't messing with you like that no more right and that you fake as hell for having your friends beat her up on tv so out of nowhere you talk about her son being inworded and that she inworded you all of a sudden what this never came about she never talked about this now, there are allegations about um, Tashiki when it comes to their nephew, Tristan. And he actually has allegations about pretty much all of the Malones. But even his stuff is kind of in question. Um, would I be surprised if it's true? Not at all. Like I said, the family been through a lot. They they weird. Let's be honest. They got a lot of trauma. They mama been fighting addiction for years. Ain't no telling what uh, the Malones been subjected to, you know, throughout the years, right? But I just had my questions because he even came out and said he questions why Krayshawn has came out when she said recently and he's saying he know what happened to him what happened you know actually happened he's not sure about Krayshawn's story right and he he even has a history of stuff remember with you know napping people and holding people hostage it's it's insane it's insane okay but hear me out remember okay remember Tashiki was denying Taking the cameras right after you know uh, Jay and Marsh jumped on her in the sprinter, but Tay Tay, the friend that just you know went off on uh, on Krishan right here, right? She admits that they do got the cameras, so that's what I'm saying. You we still catching them all in some lies, and I don't care what y'all say. Uh, Tashiki ain't no 29. She ain't 20 nothing. I could have swore she said she was 30. Or damn near 30 when uh, Krishan first got on the scene. I think Tashiki's in her mid-30s. So that's another thing too, allegedly. Alright, so we we catching them all in lies. Alright, Tashiki not completely innocent. Alright, look. I have been saying wasn't nobody there because guess what? We got their camera. Somebody got your jump. Yes, you did. You bumped up and took what? Hold on. If it, if, it, if I, I you like I beat the shit out of you right now. You took the GoPros. You took the you took the GoPros. You took the cameras. GoPros, right? You took the GoPros out the GoPros. Yes, you did. So why? Where the, where the footage at? Where the where the footage at? Where the footage at? They have. She said, "Where the footage at of them jumping on her?" Even though I, I do believe they, they jumped on her because why did Janet uh, apologize? Uh-oh. SpaghettiOs. All right. But I'm just saying that she do got the footage. Okay. I, I, I'm saying she do got the footage, right? But that don't mean that Janet and um, Marsh didn't jump 
to Cheeky. He literally apologized to her. Why would she apologize? Why would Janet apologize to Tashiki for jumping on her if she didn't jump on her? The Rock Tars not go. They they not gonna answer that. They not gonna answer that. Let me see if I can find that uh that post real quick. Cause she she definitely apologized. Hold on, let me see. She said, "I'm sorry for what I did. I was doing that for Krishan. I was out of my mind. So if that never happened." What's this about? Krishan ex-friend Janet gives an apology to Tashiki for altercation on baddies. Okay? Hey, I hope you're holding up. I apologized to your mom a while back, but I wanted to apologize to you myself. Tashiki says, apology and accountability. Uh, I forgive you. So, you know, two things can be right at the same time. Um, they really did jump on her and I believe Smiley did too, right? But, um, she lying about not, you know, having the footage. All right. I think she lying about not having the footage, the direct footage. Cause I guess the GoPro got the direct footage and you know, it's all about timing. Don't be surprised if, if that, uh, if that footage gets leaked. Okay. Don't be surprised. If the footage uh, gets leaked somehow, you know, for some money, TMZ or something like that. But as of now, you know, Tay Tay admits that they got the footage. All right. Tashiki saying that they don't. Where the footage at? Why would I be here? Where the footage at? Where the footage at? You bumping it to me and somebody had to step in the way because I'm pregnant. Shut the fuck up and say wasn't nobody there because guess what? We got their camera. Uh oh. This was regarding the fight that happened on the Sprinter with uh, Marsh, Jay, and Tifa. Tifa and her friends were able to spin their own narrative because the footage was taken by Tifa and given them in the crowd. Nah, that that that's not spinning a narrative. Nah, I, I'm not I'm not buying that. I'm not buying that. I'm not buying that. I'm sorry. I know you don't. I know you don't believe that. I know you don't believe that. That's why I'm not jumping. That's why I just got it. There's no spinning on no narrative. I think I believe it happened. What the hell is Janet, you know, Jay apologizing for? Okay, they jumped on her, but she got the footage, so we don't got the direct, you know, footage of them doing it. I guess you know to save embarrassment. I don't know. I don't know. Um, because as of now, you know, Tashiki ain't took no L's. That's the closest thing to an L we've seen her. She's been beating everybody up. You know, so we haven't seen her take an L. That would have been us actually seeing it. But, you know, apparently her and Tay got the footage. And she denies it, though. So who lying? Somebody got you jumped. Yes, you did. You bumped up and took what? Hold on. If it, if, it, if I, I you like I beat the shit out of you right now. You took the GoPros. You took the GoPros, right? You took the GoPros out the. the GoPros. Yes, you did. Right, so why? Where the, where the footage at? Where the where the footage at though? Where the footage at? They have the Where the footage at? Why would I be here? Where the footage at? Where the footage at? You bumping into me and somebody had to step in the way because I'm pregnant. I don't know. I don't know. She said you try to fight me and people try, got to step in the way because she's pregnant. She's just, like, she just, she's really good at just spinning. She's good at spinning the narrative and she manipulates. She got, she got the cult, the Krishan cult, y'all, the Chris stalkers. Y'all know what it is. Okay. Um, even charity knows she's full of ish. Okay. Even charity, um, even charity no, she full of ish. She had to uh, she had to laugh at her and smirk at her because they know they all full of ish. Okay, charity full of ish too. They, all, bro, I don't believe none of these people. I don't believe none of these people. None of them alone. Okay, but check this out. Shout out to Black Tea Queens for the post. She says, um, she talking about she uh, pursuing a music career, but she don't uh, talk about being a neglectful mother. Um, and then they said the side eye and laughed at Krishan is full of ish. Right, the charity. So. After Tashiki left, she started pillow talking to Charity, acting like she ain't scared of Tashiki. Oh, I would have said all of this to her face. I ain't, I, I ain't scared. I, I would have said all this to her face. Well, why you didn't say it then? 
Come on, man. And why he didn't put that baby down? We had we saw some random dude carrying the baby. Why he couldn't just hold the baby? Uh, the rock stars in the comments. Where is the po her? Where is baby supposed to be? What are you talking about? That's stupid. No, the baby's obviously sleep, right? We obviously saw in the background some random dude holding the baby. Why he couldn't hold the baby in the background while she sat down and went to Shiki? Make it make sense. Come on, man. But y'all know what they gonna say. Leave Benny alone! Please! <laughs> music no more i do gospel music now i do gospel music now all right hood gospel right <laughs> it's all in the eye she don't even believe herself she don't even believe herself Ooh. look at charity laughing she knows she's full of it. Who know you better than your own siblings? And it's not even like, no, y'all grew up in other house. No, these, they grew up together for the most part. She know her. She laughing. That's nice, bro. Come on, man. That's hilarious. Look, when you know somebody bull, uh, BSing, that's how you look at them. That's how you look at them. But, you know, Charity is saying that she's not choosing sides. All right? Because at the premiere, they was on the red carpet and she was standing on business for her sister. Saying, I'm not, you know, I'm not getting in between it. That's between them. blah 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 But remember, she said that she's not, um... She said she's not uh, getting in between it. She's not choosing a side. But she also said that Krayshawn was lying. All right, Tessa the beggar, Tangerine, and Charity all teamed up and said that uh, Krishan is lying. And uh, Latifah Tashiki even said that the story that Krishan is claiming that happened to her actually happened to her and Charity. She's telling a story. Come on, man. Let's see what she had to say. <laughs> I get to do my professionals because I didn't do what they wanted me to do. it today. You can't pay me nothing for this. I don't do that. Stop doing shit. 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 They said Zeus tried to pay her, okay, to lie on her sister. She said she said she's not doing that. And Tashiki started uh crying. And you see Jayla giving her that look because it get real serious. Jayla giving her that look like, uh-oh. Uh oh. Come on, man. Hey, I didn't do what they wanted me to do. Do it today. You can't pay me nothing for August. I don't do that. Stop doing shit. Stop doing shit. Y'all, y'all know I'm random. I get to do my professional. It's the man in me, y'all. Jayla was wearing that dress. Lord have mercy, Jayla look good right there. Drop dick on the bitch. Drop a dick on the, drop a dick on the bitch. Uh, uh, drop a dick on the bitch. What? Oh shit! You ain't gonna under, understand everything. And everything ain't meant for you to understand. Man, she look good. My bad, y'all. I'm just looking like man, Jayla look good as hell right there. Anyways, um, yeah, so Jayla was looking like, oh, like, okay, what the hell? You know, she like, man, I'm Zeus trying to pay me to lie on my sister. I guess they wanted her to agree with Krayshawn allegations because y'all saw she came with Krayshawn. She didn't come with uh Tashiki. She came with as a uh, support for Krayshawn saying that, you know, she made she came there to referee to make sure that they that they don't fight, which I gotta give her credit. I thought, you know, I could see charity like crashing out more she was actually pretty civil 
you know, she didn't really take a side. She was like kind of like a listening ear and kind of wanting them to like, you know, let bygones be bygones, you know, even though it, it didn't, you know, but, you know, she tried, you know, you said the Malone's ghetto as hell, uh, uh, N is, N is, you said Krishan will say and do anything to keep the spotlight. Yes, she will. Yes, she will. All right. But yeah, uh, female, female Dookie had, had something to say. And Tashiki started crying. Do it today. Oh man. Yeah. So uh she got more to say. And she was on the bus with this, y'all. Um, I know in major cities, um, I, I'm, I'm maybe Baltimore is, is different I, I, or unless it, is she's still in LA. Cause th this was just last night. She was in LA. So charity's on the bus. I don't know. Y'all let, y'all, y'all let me know what, 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 what she on. It looked like she was on the bus, which is very interesting, but she's on the bus spilling her tea. Okay. About what's going on, you know. Uh, with, with the family saying that she's not going to turn on her sisters, okay? It says, Charity says that uh, she's not taking no sides between her sister, Krishana and Tashiki, okay? Um, Stop coming at me with that. Oh, you taking a side. I'm not taking a side. Nothing. Right is right. Wrong is wrong. Y'all sound dumb as shit. Am I bashing Krishana? No, I'm not. Am I telling everything? No, I'm not. Am I showing shit? No, I'm not. I'm rocking with the T because I know what really was going on, what the plan was. Stop coming at me. Mind y'all business. Y'all fans, weird as shit. Y'all don't y'all don't know what's going on. This is family business. Mind your business. Stop saying I'm taking a side or over for Sean did this and that. Blah blah. That don't mean shit. Y'all, these people were on a paid subscription television show. Meaning that people are literally paying to see your business okay um so they talking about uh pay attention you know mind your business this is our business okay once we pay that subscription for zeus okay you're online telling all y'all damn business Krayshawn didn't even get paid to say what she said about tashiki she was just on ig live they just sat down on zeus for money spilling all of their tea all of the family business all the family trauma what the hell is you talking about? Mind your business. Y'all is our business. This is content. Y'all on public platforms telling us all your damn business. I'm telling you, the Malones is not all the way there, bro. But let me remind y'all, bro. When school was over, when high school was done, they just freed all the special ed kids out into the world, didn't tell us who was who or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Our whole lives in school, we were separated. We knew who were who. We knew, all right, they get the tripping, don't even pay them no mind. They special ed, you know what I'm saying? After high school, they let them out into society, and we don't know, bro. So when somebody trying, you just remember, they probably them. That's probably them right there, bro. Come on, man. Let, let, let's talk about it. Stop stop playing. <laughs> this is absolutely insane. She did, okay, she did what she did. Okay, I appreciate it. That don't mean, because she did start for me. I'm supposed to rock with fuck shit and a lie. Y'all weird as shit. Y'all sound dumb as shit. Y'all said all this and that. Y'all don't even know motherfucker want to buy you to do weird shit to other family members. I don't rock like that. Stop playing with me. Get the fuck out of my face. That got me fucked up. I don't care if you fuck with me or not. I stand for something. Stop coming, stop coming at me with that. Oh, you taking a side. I'm not taking a side. Nothing right is right, wrong is wrong. Y'all sound dumb as shit. Am I bashing for Sean? No, I'm not. Am I telling everything? No, I'm not. Am I showing shit? No, I'm not. I'm rocking with Latifah because I know what really was going on and what the plan was. Stop coming at me. Mind y'all business. Y'all fans weird as shit. Y'all don't, don't know what's going on. This is family business. Mind your business. Stop saying I'm taking a side or over for Sean did this and that. Blah, blah, blah. That don't mean shit. Okay, she did what she did. Okay, I appreciate it. That don't mean because she did start for me. I'm supposed to rock with fuck shit and a lie. 
Y'all weird as shit. Y'all still dumb as shit. Y'all saying all this and that. Y'all don't even. I mean, that's a good point. I mean, that's a good point. She's saying like, hey, yes, Krishan has helped me out. She done some things, but, you know, if she lying and, you know, and doing this and doing that, bringing the family down and stuff like that, I'm not rocking with it. You know, even though uh, we don't trust her, we don't trust charity at all. OK, a broken clock can, is, is right twice, a, twice a day. Right. So um, I understand where she coming from, from that point, because that's real. All right. Yes, I have family members, whatever case may be or something like that. I love them. They've done things for me, helped me out, whatever case. But if they on some F stuff, if they on some effery, lying, cheating, stealing, doing, you know what I mean? Doing some crazy stuff, crazy false allegations, whatever. I'm not rocking with them. I'm not agreeing with them. Even though motherfucker want to buy you to do weird shit to other family members. I don't rock like that. Stop playing with me. Get the fuck out of my face. She said so she basically just admitted that Krayshawn tried to pay her to turn on uh Tashiki, to side with Tashiki. I mean to side with Krayshawn and agree and go along with her story and go against her. He said no, she not doing it. That got me fucked up. I don't care if you fuck with me or not. I stand for something. Stop coming, stop coming at me with that. Oh, you taking the side. I don't know, man. I don't know. But um, I'm going to keep you all updated with this because this is not the last we're going to hear from this. I kind of find it um interesting, too, that Charla is supposed to be in rehab right now, too. So we haven't heard from Charla. OK, uh, Tangerine has already spoken out and she side with Tashiki. Uh, Tessa the beggar has spoken out. She side with Tashiki. OK, it seemed like everybody is against Krishan other than. Her nephew, who uh, put out the allegations in the first place, and he even questions why, you know, she came out all of a sudden and said this and waited to be on a platform. He said, hey, he knows what happened to him. He don't know about what happened to um, Krayshawn, which is interesting because he was around, right? He's older than her. Okay, so I don't know, but I'm going to keep y'all updated, y'all. I'm going to keep y'all updated. All right.